Hi, this is Beth Kephart. I'm the author of Flow and other Philadelphia books. And I'm thinking, as I know we all are, about the physicians and nurses, police people, firefighters, first responders, delivery people who are doing everything they can on behalf of the rest of us during this unprecedented time. A lot of them are away from the river they love, the Schuylkill River, where they walk, where they talk, where they fish, where they row. And so I'm reading a short passage from Flo for them today with some photographs I've taken along the way to accompany the words. This is from a chapter called Renditions. He settles the legs of his easel into the dirt, fixes his canvas upright, mingles his tints, and tests one brush then another. Patient as a hawk, he waits as if I might or could romance my own portrait, some in loveliness for immortality's sake. But the clouds move at their own pace and the sun asserts itself or it does not, and I am my age, the color of the years gone by. I am fish bones and car parts, the eye sockets of muskrats, a library card and a checkbook, the broken metal plate of an old gas grill, a hammer, some nails, a tool belt, the click of whelk, an arrowhead, the dull gray of an expanded bullet. I am stones and silt, trust me. Still he waits, still every day he comes and works the legs of that easel into the skin of that earth. If I could dance for him, I would rumba. If I could turn my surface into sequins, I would shimmy by.